in the girls or if I actually have actual eggs. And how cool is this though? Like the apartment setup with the ARS stuff like that? It's super unique and cool. I'm excited. So like I've never seen this done in person. Which girl do you want to start with? Let's do... What do you have girls that are small and big in here? Yeah. Start with your biggest girls. Okay. okay. Alright. So Hold her head. Or what? Alright, so no, I just want you to look at the screen just like Ryan does. I'm loading... Oh, 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 oh. Go over this side, honey. No. Okay. So you'll see basically circles. If she has anything, it's gonna be dark. So just get ready. Okay. I mean, I see some. Bring, bring, bring it up to the, me. bring it up to the top real fast. Okay. Yeah, yeah pull it up to the top one so I can kind of see what we're doing here. Can I hold it? Yeah. That's yeah, so absolutely. Perfect. Right. You're gonna have to. <clears throat> Yep. Where, what am I looking at, Ryan? Hold on, we'll show you. Yeah. Uh, give me that gel real fast. If you look precious. It's not picking up on the uh, camera it's not going real to well. More than likely. Which okay. is, but it's still. Oh, there, no, it's no, perfect. No, 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 that's it. That's just fresh yeah. gel. There we go. Nope. All right, you see those at the very top. Yeah. The little bitty guys. Follicles. Circle so she, ones right there. It, yeah. So those circles right there. Oh. So if I freeze the picture. What's that right there? Which one? Yep, Wait. the top one. Is it this circle so or the that little bitty circle right there is a follicle, and that would be that, like, that would be like a point five. Okay. Yeah, when when they start like really smashing food, uh -huh. that's when they'll start growing very quickly. Yeah, she's like beast, right? Now. She's, that's why I said she's eating like. A oh, monster. she's eating still. Yeah. Oh, okay, like a yeah. Monster. This one is not <clears throat> eating. <clears throat> And she's not pairing. And what was she the pairing? What was what was the pairing with the orange dream head clown? Oh yeah, you can see how, how pink her belly is. She's definitely in shit right now. Banana pastel head clown. So nothing special. To an orange dream head clown. Yes. Got it. But if I were to hit all those jeans, Ozzy made that uh, world's first. I think back in. And it was pastel banana OD clown. Yep. Which would be a pretty dope snake though, yeah, with so nice. all of it combined. So what do you have here? This is a highway. And it was paired to what? A yellow belly pastel G stripe. And what do you want to get from that? I eventually want to make genetic stripe highway. Right, Got it. <clears throat> so that was the um, reason for this pairing and project. But honestly, I'd be happy for some just, I mean, pastel highway and G stripe. Oh. Oh. Not yet. Oh, well, there we go. Yep. At the bottom now. So they're big dark circles. I'm trying, I'm trying to get them all. But whitish, right? Around no, the edges. Uh, you'll, you'll see a border. Okay, right there. Freeze it. Top, top left. Yep. That's an egg. That's an egg. What is? That. This. You, you see, see this perfect round shape right That's here? That's an egg. That's an egg. She has eggs in her. <laughs> well, it's, okay, yeah. We need to we need to we need to rephrase it. It's not an egg yet. But okay. but okay, so where does she go? Well, it's, we're gonna check the size, and if it's so over, show you what it'll look like. yeah, we're gonna measure it. So let's keep right. an eye on this ultrasound. All right. So I need my book. Yeah, and what did you pair her to? I paired her to the same banana pastel head clown. Okay, so a pastel head clown. Pastel banana head clown to a pastel head clown. Yeah. Cool. All right. Killer banana clown. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to do. Yeah, that. Huh? All right, so. There's follicles. Um, if they are, they're small. So I think I'm. Look at this. Here we go. Set up. Really cool for an apartment, guys. <clears throat> it's 
Today is the final, or I'm sorry, Sweet 16, downtown Indy. Beautiful day. Precious this apartment. Beautiful. Awesome. So this is a desert ghost and it was paired to, let me guess, super chocolate hypo het desert ghost. Yeah. <laughs> All visual babies. Yeah. No. Oh, oh. Do you want me to uh, hold the tail or anything? No, her tail's fine. So her gallbladder will be up here. And if you can find her gallbladder, then she can't produce eggs any higher than the gallbladder. So how many females did you pair again this year? Uh, seven. Seven. Okay, cool. Yeah, I just don't feel very much right now on her. But again. And she hasn't been on the cool side at all. Okay. Yeah, she, to grow, they'll have to go on the cool side. <clears throat> Lesser. In, yep. Uh, banana butter. Cinnamon. So Don't. You shouldn't have told. Shouldn't have told Baker that. He hates like all those jeans. <laughs> I know. Like, oh, I thought like literally a bunch of basic ass jeans. What? But, what, but it was paired to the super chocolate as well. Yeah. yeah. So it would be head DG. Pot no head no, hypo pos head DG. Um, but. Yeah, and I'm basing that off of your last video with your where you showed all your breeding plans. So. Alright. My memory's not mistaken. That's a beautiful pied though, by the way. Yeah. Pastel pied? Uh fire. Fire. But she's also possible cinnamon, possible sandblast, possible pet <clears throat> EPI exam. Jesus. I that's but that's sandblast was Osborne. originally by Brandon. And that's why I thought that. I'm sorry. Oh, okay. Because Brandon Osborne, yeah, sandblast stuff is his. And I paired her to the Hypo Pie. Yeah, and Baker knows him. And I actually just saw him on a he did a video with MJ. MJ Exotics? Uh the Juarez, yeah, MJ Exotics Cartel. That was actually the first time I'd ever heard Brandon Osborne speak, or actually even seen an updated thing of him. So what a hell of a drummer. That's what I, yeah, that's what I hear. I would love to go down there. You'd have to hook that up. Wait, wait, what, what, what's that? Look at that. What is that? Um, that could be your tall. Yeah. No way. So that would be a round outline right here. Do you see it? Yeah. That that's a, there's the that's an egg that's an egg. Yes, it is, dude. That's huge. Yeah, if it is. So there's another see, one. See how they go back to back? Yeah. There's the end and there's the start. Round. Yeah. Look, look, that is an egg. Yeah. Yes, yeah. It, that is an egg. Yeah, so I think she's already ready. <clears throat> Yo, okay, so. So a whole clutch of pies. Yes. 100% head hypo. Yes. With fire. Yes. So possible like fire pie. But if they're this big, you should easily get a top. <laughs> what? It's awesome! Yeah. yeah. So there they are right there. She already maybe. She already maybe getting ready to go. Yeah. Yep. So you see? Oh wow. You can already see the, the yeah. thing from the side. Yep. Just you see the the belly's not flat anymore. Yeah, it's, it's round. Not. But again. So I just want to give a quick update on everything that just happened. You saw Ryan recording me and Baker looking at the ultrasound and snakes. So I put some stickers on the tub to kind of uh, simulate what is going on with the follicle. So I have uh, my highway girl that we went ahead and ultrasound and she is sitting at 35 millimeters um, as far as the follicles in her. So she's no longer on food. Uh, 
Uh, she's been in the GP3 for about two to three months, and she is no longer locking with the mail that I put in. I think I tried maybe like a couple weeks ago. So that's really, really great. So that means that she probably will be going to very, very high probability. Um, so I'm really excited about that. Um, we also did my Orange Dream Hat Clown. She's in Shed. Baker did say that it's harder to catch the eggs on the ultrasound when they're in Shed. So, but she didn't really show great signs either. So I'm gonna continue to pair her. Um, it's not too late to continue pairing, so uh, she could just be in very early stages of building her follow -up. Um, We did my Desert Ghost Girl, and she also, <laughs> <sorry>. <laughs> What have you been pairing her to? Uh, the super chocolate hypo. <laughs> so, AKA all visual things. Exactly. So, you know, she's still eating great. Um, she's not like really, I would say maybe within the last week or so, she's been kind of moving towards the colder side of the tongue. So that might be a good sign, but she's locking, she's eating, and you know, there's still possibility that she can go this year. So that's great. And then this girl, which is a pastel pet clown, she was another one that didn't show um, any signs of like follicular growth. So it could either still be very early or she could just not be going. Um, then it looks like my banana left her cinnamon. She was another girl that had signs of follicular growth, very early stages, uh, 1.5 centimeters, 15 millimeters. Uh, so she's still eating really good. She's one of my best eaters. She eats whatever you put in there. And um, she's also showing really good signs, sitting on the full side of the tub. So I'm really excited about that. I'm going to continue to her. And then this last girl, which is the fire pie paired to the hypo pie. She also has a bunch of possible genes in her. She showed really, really great signs, um, which to my understanding, really big follicles that could turn into eggs once she ovulates, or once she ovulates, they will turn into eggs, but, so that's great. She, um, interesting though, because she's still walking, she's still eating, so we'll see how that, how that pans out. Um, but yeah, so tonight we're getting the storm um, in, and I'm gonna go ahead and put um, males to females. My super chocolate is one that I've paired to multiple females, so, be like, you know, once he blocks and separates, I'll have to like, you know, continue carrying with the females. But it's really, really good day to do this because um, with the storm, you know, the barometric pressure um, really stimulates breeding uh, for these animals. So um, it's a really, really good time to pair them. So I'll go ahead and do that and I'll keep you guys updated on breeding. So wishing you luck, but thank you guys for watching. And hey, if you're if your uh, super chocolate needs a break, maybe we'll bring the Wookiee Desert Ghost over. Right, exactly. Oh God, please. Yeah.